Do you need help? We can call an ambulance. Typhon's been lying to all of you. And so has Jed Lucan. Alex, what's going on? Fuck you. What the hell happened? I was down in the mine last night. I saw what Typhon's been hiding for 12 years. Jed Lucan isn't a hero. That whole story is a lie. Jed caused the accident. And then he abandoned seven of his men. He let them drown to save himself. There were pictures of me and Gabe down there in the dirt. Because one of those miners was my father. Fucking hell, dude. Typhon wanted to keep this covered up in case it jeopardized the vote. You're ruthless. Everyone at that company is scared to death. All they do is protect themselves. So they decided to bury the evidence. And nothing was going to stop that blast. Not even the fact that there were four people up in the mountains. That's how Gabe was killed. Jed knew all along. He covered up the truth about the past, about Gabe. And when I found out, as you can see, he tried to kill me too. Why aren't any of you saying anything? We don't want to embarrass you, Alex. I wasn't asking you. The things you've said obligate me to at least address them. These accusations are, well, they're insane. And trying to go into the mine was obviously a very dangerous, very illegal thing to do. But we all sympathize with your situation. You've been through so much. Holy your shit. Your was your only family, wasn't he? I can only imagine how much you want an explanation for his loss. Something to give you comfort and make your life seem less unfair. Why don't you just tell the truth? You've been planning your exit from Typhon anyway. What? You never signed up for threats or attempted murder. You hate this. Now's your chance. Yeah, Jesus. Didn't have to go down Dad, this way. Do you have any idea what Alex is talking about? No. I don't. I've tried to be there for Alex since Gabe died. I thought, I don't know. I hoped I could be something of a father figure to her. All I can guess is, sometimes when we're hurting, the people we lash out at are the ones who are trying to help. You're lying. This is an act. You're lying. Please. I know this is hard to accept. You all trust him. I did too, but I'm telling the truth. I believe you. Of course I do. I believe you too. Oh shit. I'm horrified and shocked and still processing everything, but I believe you.
Ryan's not gonna believe me. I would like to speak. Ducky. This young lady came to Haven as a stranger. But over the last few weeks, she's become one of us. Now, her story certainly seems unlikely, if not impossible. But she deserves at least an investigation of her claims. We ought to take her seriously. Ducky, you're being unhelpful. Alex, sweetheart. You know our mind can play tricks on us. None of it is your fault. Are you serious? It's so hard to admit you need help. But struggling alone... No. You shouldn't have to go through that. We're all worried about you. Let us help you. Come on, Pike. Come on, Pike. How about you? I heard you out last night. You know the deal. Please. You're a cop. You can do something. Alex, just... just give it up. You coward. <clears throat> Damn, dude. Ryan, will you back up what I'm saying? Please. Why are you doing this? What? My dad is not a murderer. He 100% is. Holy fuck. Are you afraid we couldn't get Typhon? Is that why you need someone else to blame? No. You tried to I thought we were in this together for Gabe. You tried to shoot me in the fucking head, bro. Ryan. No. I'm not gonna let you do that to me anymore. Ryan, what the hell? I know he's your dad, but look at her. Why would she lie about this? It's going too far. Alex almost died. It's not true. Fuck you, Ryan! After everything? Seriously, fuck you! Stop. I know why you tried to kill me. It's not what you tell yourself. That you thought it was best for Haven. This was never about Haven at all, was it? This was about you. I know it's easier not having to think about the men you buried. You want to look away and pretend the people you hurt. This is fucking people. extreme, dude. But I won't let you. Make him feel everything. My father worked for you. His name was John. The world never gave a shit about him. He was always struggling just to get by. He still hoped one day things would be better. But you killed him.
fucking hell. My big brother. He was building a family here. Doing it his own way. Figuring it out as he went along. He was so nervous about it. And so excited. And he brought me here to be part of that family. But he died. Because of you. Fucking hell. And then there's me. For so many years, I just wanted to survive. Yeah. Get through. Yeah, dude. Haven changed me. I started to think about the future. That's a plumier, that's a plumier. Playing on stage yesterday was one of the best moments I can remember. Gabe knew that about me. He knew that if I could just play, just let myself love something, then one day I could be happy. And you tried to murder me. You would have ended my life just so you wouldn't have to face the truth. Come on, Jeb. You've forgotten it. Haven't you? You've plastered over it with another story. You tell yourself you're a hero. A strong leader. Sometimes that means making hard choices. Ooh. Decisions Farks. that could lead to people dying. A few men could handle that. Haven's lucky to have you. But that's the lie. If you scrape it away, what do we see? You're a coward, yourself, you're a pawn. You're a coward. Eleven years ago, you led a group of men to their deaths. And you couldn't even say those words out loud because you're a coward. You couldn't imagine saying it to your wife, saying it in front of your son. Every day you were brave enough to go underground and look death in the eye, but you couldn't muster the courage to admit a mistake. I can feel you trying to pull away. Don't. The truth hurts. Fuck. Sometimes yeah. Sometimes it's so awful you think you're gonna break. Just come clean, man. But when you come out the other side, and you're whole and free and still alive, then you'll finally know how strong you really are. Just admit it. I see the truth about you. Holy shit. You hate yourself. You hate what you did in the past. You hate what you've done to keep it secret. And the more you deny that hatred, the worse it gets. The worse it grows. Ooh. Okay. Fuck. I know who you are. I've seen the worst parts of you. <laughs> but I forgive you, and I condemn you. I condemn you, but I forgive you. And I forgive you. 
Okay, that was an abrupt cut seat, a floating screen, but sick. <laughs> 